Hi guys, it's Jenny. Welcome to our YouTube. I'm here to show you Always by Raquel Welch. This is a legacy style. She's been around for a very long time. In fact, this is Raquel Welch's very favorite. And can't you see why? I mean, I feel like a little movie star in this style. I absolutely love this one. I have overlooked this so many times. While here in the studio, I tried her on for the first time and just felt like, I don't know, fancy maybe? I don't know what I feel like, but I feel like something else. <laughs> I initially took her out of the box and the curls are barrel curls and they're a little on the tighter side, which is fine, but they need a little loosening up just to kind of fluff up a little bit. The volume is amazing on this one. There's a little bit of permatease all throughout. The cap is basic, so no lace top, no frills. It's your basic cap and it fits like a glove. It's amazing, I love it. I'll show you here just to kinda give you a little look under the cover. You have your wefts here, flexible, comfortable. Your not extended nape, it's just a regular nape here with adjustable tabs, half inch, either tighter or looser, depending on your head circumference. I am a 21.5 inch head circumference and I usually take my tabs to right about the middle on each one. And on my Raquel Welch's, it fits like a dream. It's perfect. Um, the cap is average sized. This also comes in a large size for larger circumference heads. Um, mine fits perfect, it's great. This color, I'll go over both of the colors, this one, is shaded cappuccino. The color code on it is RL1222SS. And the SS stands for your shaded root. I prefer a shaded root, but I don't have to have a shaded root. It's just kind of, it's preference. On these wavier curly styles with your roots, I love the highlights just kind of thrown in. They don't have to go all the way down to the root like that. It's such a beautiful, beautiful voluminous style. This Honey Toast, I'll give you a closer look at the color, R1216 is light brown. It's described as light brown, evenly blended with dark neutral highlights. And I would describe this as a very warm color, kind of ginger, I guess you would say. I'll give you a 360 just to kind of show you all around but you have your layers up throughout. You have volume, volume. The side swept bang is so perfect on this one. It just swoops so nicely. It doesn't fall in your face. It's just there. It's perfect. It's the perfect haircut, the perfect style. I love this one. I can tell why this is a bestseller for good, good reason. So pretty. We're gonna go ahead and style up and fluff up the one right out of the box. All right, so right out of the box, you can see that it needs some adjusting, right? You can see that it needs some fluffing out. So right out of the box, you can tell that it needs something. I mean, you actually don't need to do much to this one, but it kind of depends on what you're looking for. If you wanna keep these barrel curls like you just curled it out of the curling iron and just kind of fingered through, you can keep it this way. But if you wanna go through with a wide tooth comb, I always suggest to start at the bottom and kinda of work your way up. Usually I'll give these wigs a little bit of a shake before putting them on just to kinda of loosen the fibers up a little bit. I didn't this time, but that's okay. Let's see how this goes. So I'll comb through gently, comb through, and just kinda of fluff up. Separate those fibers, wake them up. And with this shaded cappuccino, you will unleash these highlights throughout. This color is such a beautiful color to transition from your summer blonde to a darker shade in fall and winter. It's such a beautiful, beautiful color. I'll turn around and give you the 360. Again, I didn't really touch these curls in the back. I left them. I just kind of fluffed out the ones on the side and honestly, I didn't even do anything with this front fringe. It just is what it is, and it's gorgeous. 
On the other one in Honey Toast, I did part it a little bit further over and the bangs were swept a little bit more to the side, but I'm kind of liking this. It's so nice. Anyway, tell me what you think.